Welcome back everyone, Happy New Year. Hope you enjoyed the holidays. So we're back for our fourth part in the series on how to improve that upper body, lower body separation for a better swing sequence in your golf. The, we're gonna be using all of those drills that you've been practicing on regarding how to use our core to affect the position and the movement of our torso and our pelvis. So here's a couple more drills that integrate everything into more of a swing sequence. Here we go. So the first drill, you get myself into Golf stance, grab yourself a club, put it right in the middle of your stance. Address the ball or the club. Put a bit of pressure down here so the upper body stays quiet. And we're gonna use that stiffness in the core, that core bracing we've been working on to rotate the pelvis back and then rotate it through, right? So you're trying to keep the upper body from moving as I flex the core to rotate. It's not something I'm doing through my knees here. I'm really keeping the knees just soft, pushing the pelvis using the core. Back and forth. You can try 10 to 20 of those. So the second drill, I'm trying to integrate it into much more of a swing sequence. Okay, so if I'm a right-handed golfer, I want the whole body to move and load into my back post leg here. So again, have the hands put some pressure between them, create some stiffness in the core, and then Use them to rotate the hips and the torso down the target line. Right? Keep that trail shoulder down so you're working on that spine angle. Okay, so we'll do 10 of those, get that backswing sequence. From the top, we're looking for the hips to lead and then the torso to go, right? So it's a little bit different, but what we're going to try to do here is engage the core and try to rotate towards the target as I push up through this left side, and then finish down the line with the torso and the finish position, right? So flex, brace the core, drive the hips, and then finish by reaching down the line. So I hope you've enjoyed these exercises. They are just the fundamentals of some of the movement patterns that are super important in your golf swing. If you have any questions, please reach out. I look forward to hearing from you. Take care.